Hey yo, I'm Tita Ferrone and welcome back to Veronaville. In this episode of Port Taylor, we'll be joining the Mullins household. That's Mullins. <laughs> so here is Joel, right where we left him last time, asleep in his bed. So now, let's move on to the ROS. Okay, so no major event for Joel, but his minor event says, Roommate Wanted. You've been struggling with money, so a roommate sounds like a good idea to give you extra cash and them a place to stay. Right now, there are six townies, so I'll roll a number from one through six. And now, re-roll. Alright, townie number two, which is... Emmett Devereaux. Oh, looks like we missed seeing Joel get out of bed. Sorry. I don't understand why you'd want music on and TV. It sounds very overwhelming if you ask me. And with that, a townie becomes a playable. Emmett has brought with him 10k simoleons, which is pretty helpful. Emmett is a pleasure sim with a secondary aspiration of romance. His lifetime want is to become game designer but that will not happen for him, not in Port Taylor. He is a Gemini. He's pretty sloppy, a bit more on the outgoing side, a bit more on the active side, but he's neither serious or playful and either grouchy or nice. His chemistry is that he likes facial hair, charismatic sims, but he does not like gray hair. Emma's traits are hot-headed, great kisser, schmoozer, loves the outdoors, and brave. And Emmett's hobby is nature. Thankfully, Joel has a spare room, so Emmett will be taking this room while he lives here. Before we start furnishing his room, let's see what he has in his inventory. That's it. Yeah, let's sell these easels. Okay, we're gonna keep that one. All right, so now let's furnish his room. Okay, I think that's good enough for now. Okay, so Emmett wants to pull a prank, play on the couch, go swimming, and play with someone. Whoa. Okay, so yeah. They're not supposed to have Max's careers, so unfortunately he will be unemployed for now. He's gonna go quit his job that he cannot have. We're gonna see what Joel would like to do. Oh yeah, fall in love and make these two friends. It's a bit early to call anyone. Um, so... Oh, let me check out Emmett skill, see if he has any. Okay. He has a cooking skill point. And he has four mechanical, four charisma, four creativity, two body and logic, and one cleaning. Okay, Emmett. What about Joel's skills? He has none. Well, since Emmett already has a cooking skill point, I'll have Emmett cook for them both. Unless I let Joel just make them both some cereal real quick. Alright, Emmett just quit his job. No oh, Max's career, so I'm very sorry. Oh, I was gonna let you jump on the couch, because that's, that's apparently what you want to do. You couldn't at least put the book away? Why are you putting the book in Joel's room? You really could have just easily put it away. So Joel will go ahead and make them both some cereal. 
his dream came true of jumping on the couch. Aw, Emmett wants to be friends with Joel, of course. He does not find Joel attractive at all, apparently. <laughs> Perhaps you're talking about the passing of Sierra Westbrook and getting the new mayor, Savion. And perhaps Emmett is saying, yeah, he likes the new mayor. Because, you know, he's got some chemistry for him. Oh, he's working at Fun Motive and P. So Emmett wants to go on vacation, but the vacation destinations are locked and it will be for a very long time. Like, it's going to be forever until we can get to that point. Because before we do that, we still going to lock university. It's going to be a long while before we can get vacation destinations, unfortunately. Since it is his hobby, he will be hunting for bugs. Just keep trying. You'll get it. There you go. Trihorn Greaves Beetle. Good job. It's not he has a book box. Oh, it's okay, buddy. So now let's go on to work. Oh, good job on that prancer beetle. Where's the walk to lot option? I can't find it. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> Alright, off to work. Here we are, back at Fresh Take. No bench, Joel. Go open the store. And go ahead and call in Abby. I'm thinking about trying to learn how to make uniforms and then maybe i can have uniforms for the businesses but i don't know we'll see we'll definitely see oh look he wants to be friends with emmett too only feels right to lock it in for him and of course he goes and lays on that bench over there get back in the store honestly i had forgotten about these features back here until richie came over to it so how many stars do we need to get ranked two? Four. Okay. Yeah. It's gonna take some work. Lila does not like you. Looks like Lila needs some help. Loyalty star. Time to restock this. I didn't even know Caden was here. He already bought something. Sorry, Caden. Oh my goodness. I didn't know you were here. We're not going to perform the sales on Richie because he is not happy about it, apparently. Moato Fabasis Tundukrontrino, Joshua needs some help. Don't get on that bench, goddammit. Give me that to loyalty star, please. That loyalty star. Thank you. Oh boy. Jeez. <laughs> that face he made. I love it. Joel, leave that bench alone. Alright, Joshua, if you're just gonna stand around, you need to leave. Let me see what you do. 
<laughs> talking about ghost. Perhaps we're talking about Sierra. That's so sad. I'm not talking about the warlock. Perhaps Joel is saying how he was lucky enough to not get a visit from the warlock. At least I don't think he got visited by the warlock. I feel like he might have. I might be wrong. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I can't remember. It's been a while. Anyways, he needs to leave. Goodbye, Joshua. Mayor Savion, if you are not here to buy anything, I will tell you to leave. And I don't care if you're the mayor. We're gonna go ahead and ask Richie to leave, though. Alright, so he is here to buy. Mm. All right, we're gonna have to restock both of these. Loyalty star, how many more do we need? Just one. Nice. Joel, leave that bench alone. Get back in the store. It is getting very impatient. And Richie is back, of course. Maybe he'll respond better to the sale this time. Mm. Yep. Much better. Thank you, Richie. Gotta get these sales. It's gonna be so good when Joel finally gets... Oh, look! Bring two! That wasn't what I was gonna say, but that's so good. It really is. But yeah, as I was saying, it's going to be really good when they start getting the, the gold sales talent badge. Because then they can start dazzling. That is, is so good. I don't think Lisa is here to buy anything. She's been kind of standing around. So we're going to ask her to leave. I don't think he likes her. Like, like as a person. He says zero, zero. Yeah, he doesn't really care for her much. Hayden is back yet again. Ooh, Joel is pretty hungry. We're probably gonna close soon. Yes, eight. Uh, I think it's about time to close. I didn't even know Joshua was here. He's in line too. Oh, look! Bronze. Talent badge. Good job, Abby. I'm so proud of you. Now go check her out. Alright, so he did it in the bathroom. But yeah, he likes her. But they don't appear to have any bolts. Even though I can see them right here. I think that's a thing that happens sometimes. Like, they'll have bolts, but you can't, like, see them. We're gonna chat with Abby a little bit, and then we'll go ahead and head back home. <laughs> Seems like the mayor is a very popular topic right now. I mean, understandable. The original mayor passed away, and now there's a new one, and it's her twin brother. We're having a pretty long conversation right now. They probably get along pretty well. Alright, go ahead and set her home. Yeah, she's bored. Poor thing. Yeah, we're gonna get you home now. Don't worry. Finally heading home. Technically, that's the Mullins Devereaux household now, by the way. Now we're back at home of Emmett. Jeez, Joel was gone for 12 hours. A Ringo Beetle. Well, Emmett needs to use the bathroom. Oops, come on. I bet in the way. There we go. So here's Emmett's bug box. Those are the bugs he has. Kind of sad that they get pinned in there, but Emmett wants to befriend Joel, but he cannot do that right now because Joel's at work. He cannot go swimming because there's no pool anywhere in Port Taylor. We already talked about why he can't go on vacation, but he can gain a skill point. Um, actually, I think if you study cleaning 
I think that for some reason counts towards nature. He's real happy to be studying for cleaning. So Emmett needs to eat again and he needs to shower. How's he doing on that cleaning point? He's about to get it, so we'll wait for that. Sing about joining the household. How sweet. Let's have him get in the shower. No, the bed is in the way. Get in the shower. Yeah, he's starting to stink. That's so nasty. I've never had a kiwi smoothie before. Or a raspberry one, really. Never had either of those. I want to try them now. He's making a face as if it doesn't taste good. You probably put sugar in it. And I make like smoothies and stuff. I just use frozen fruit. So I don't eat sugar in it. And it's perfect. Because when you add sugar to it, it gets like that gritty texture, you know. I, I, I don't like that. I'm really sensitive to textures. Oh, he is so happy to have moved in. I'm happy you moved in too. Oh, he's singing about Joel. Yeah, he definitely wants to be friends with him. We're definitely gonna work on that, don't worry. I'll make sure- What oh, is the phone ringing? Phone's ringing. Let's see who's calling. Watch it be a prank call. Ooh, yep, it's a freaking prank call. The number three is very important in your life right now. I don't really care for the number three. My favorite number is four. Alright, he wants to read another book. Yeah, you can do that, why not? Do you want to buy a bubble blower? No. And you want to buy a computer? We can work on that. Honestly, I'll probably put it right here since we have so much open space there. Yeah. There we go. I think it looks okay. So now he wants to- he just wants to buy things. Now he wants a stereo costing at least 2000 The TV costing at least 3000 You sure do roll some expensive wants to not have a job, Emmett. Put these books away. Congratulations. Alright, now he wants to pull a prank. Well, there's nobody here to prank. We can, we can maybe invite someone over. Let's do Lisa. Alright, Lisa is not available, so we'll try someone else. I think basically any sim that has a job is not gonna make it. Let's do let's do Lila then. I know she's not working. Because she owes a business, so they're not gonna say, Oh, I'm not available. You know? It's always a pleasure to see you. I'll be right over. Okay, Lila, we'll see you shortly. Looks like Emmett wants to read a book while he waits for her arrival. At his new computer desk. Congrats on it. And there she is. Put the book away. Because your company is here. If I knew Nick was going to walk by. We'll just wait for him to walk by. She seems to be ranting. About how her business went. And he does not care. But now he just wants to talk about. Tomato soup. Tomato soup is really good, though. I like to, um... I don't dip my grilled cheese in my tomato soup. I like to take my spoon and then pour it off the spoon onto the grilled cheese. That's how I do it. Because I don't like when the crumbs from the bread get in the soup. I think it's gross. Oh my god. I hope this wasn't a mistake. They have three bolts together. And she's seeing Caden. I mean, she's a romance sim, so I would not be surprised, but... Oh my god. Something might happen, guys. I'll, I'll be honest. Something might happen. But anyways, he wanted to pull a prank. That's the whole reason he invited her over. <laughs> He's like, ooh boy, you're so bad. Oh, she, she did not like it, though. That was hot, but she ain't like it. 
Oh, he's crying. I think she's the one that should be crying, though. You're the one who shocked her. Looks like Lila is about to finish our book. And Emmett seems to want to watch TV. A movie. Come on, you guys were getting along before. Can't resist her, though, apparently. Wait, wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, guys. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I knew it was going to happen. Look, I knew it was going to happen. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, no. Not Lila is already cheating on Caden. Whoa, I'm sorry, guys. No, and they're crushing on each other now. Okay, let's leave. Look at the house I built, guys. Wow. Yeah. Let's look at the sky. Isn't that nice? Look at that nice Sims 2 sky. Where is the moon? Let's see if we can find the moon, guys. There's nothing going on in that house right there. Oh, look at that shooting star. There's the moon. Ah, nice. Sometimes when you look at the night sky on The Sims 2 or in the day sky, you can see like two moons or two suns. It's pretty cool. Look at all those shooting stars. Nothing going on in that house right there. Just a nice moon to look at. Look at that moon. Yeah. I didn't know the moon moved. What do you know? You learn something new every day, huh? Lila, you are terrible. Guys, imagine imagine she got pregnant from this. That would be awful. And then we played her household last time she and Kaden woohooed. So imagine that she did get a risky pregnancy. We would have no idea who the father is for real. I mean, we could figure it out with cheats, but you know. Well, Emmett, you might as well make her some dinner. Make some for Joel, too. But we'll use this. No, I'm clicking on the bed. Ah. There we go. Three. Make three servings of whatever you make. Let's serve a dinner of... Oh! Jambalaya! Yes, absolutely. I love Jambalaya. It is amazing. But Lila, she knew what she was doing. Lila is wrong. Oh my god, I want some jambalaya so bad. I might have to make some. Yeah, sometime this week, I should probably make me some jambalaya. That sounds so good. It's just so satisfying to watch the fire turn on. I love it. I love watching it. No burnt food. Nice. Oh, that bed. That bed is insane. I might have to buy him a new bed because this is ridiculous. Let's do that. That's good. I shouldn't have any issues now. Oh my goodness, Emmett. You don't know what you're getting yourself into right now. Maybe some part of him wouldn't even care because his secondary aspiration is romance after all. Joel should be home pretty soon. Alright. Yeah, you can go ahead and go to bed. Joel will be home soon. I feel bad to make Joel have to wash these dishes when he comes back. I'm sorry, Joel. Well, Emmett's sorry. I didn't do anything. Yeah, whatever. Go eat. You can shower in the morning. No, you're not going to sleep. You need to eat first. Emmett worked hard to make that meal for you, you know. Well, really, he didn't make it for you. He made it for him and Lila. And remember that he would be coming home from work and would like to eat. But same difference. Yeah, there's two empty plates. They ate without you. They were just finishing up as you arrived home. Let's get a closer look at that jambalaya. I love jambalaya. Am I pronouncing it right? I used to say jambalaya. 
but apparently it's jambalaya. But there's been plenty of times where I pronounced it the right way, and I got corrected to the wrong way, so I started saying it the wrong way, and I got corrected again to saying it the right way. So I just have a hard time with words. Yeah, Joel's gonna wash all the dishes for us. Just in time for the rotation to end, too. He is still hungry. He's about to pass out, so he's gonna have to eat a good breakfast in the morning. Be close. I know, Joel. Let's get you to bed right now, buddy. While he's getting into bed... Dang it, Joel. While he's getting into bed, let's go ahead and pay back some of that loan. Loan info. Not bad. They only have 15.7k to pay back now. I think rank 3's cash prize is 10k for the business. And then business rank 4 is 20k. And then rank 5 is 50k. But I'm sure the 10k would be enough. So we gotta get fresh take to rank 3. And then maybe then he can pay off that loan. We also gotta figure out something for Emmett to do. So he's just not just home just doing nothing, you know. I don't know. I might have an idea, but I might not do it. Anyways, let's go ahead and update that spreadsheet. Okay, so Joel turned 20 years old and there's a new sim. Devro Emmett. And he is the not raw mate. Roommate. Roommate is one word, right? This is R1R1. If, here, I'll explain that real quick. This part right here, that means round one. And this part means rotation one. In case anybody was um confused about what this whole R0R0 R0 thing is I have going on. It's just saying, this call is pretty much just telling me when they became a citizen of Port Taylor. It's just something fun for me to know. <laughs> but yeah, let's go ahead and finish this. Uh, ROS. And he is 19. He's a human. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot that stuff already. I have it written down in the townie sheet. Okay, he's a Gemini. The pleasure sim was a secondary of romance. His lifetime one is game designer. Poor thing can never get it. For this one, I'm just going to paste it in there. And we're going to fix the alignment and the shading. The co it's color coded. The green means they're an adult. For babies, like infants, it will be like a baby blue. And then toddlers, it'll be like a lighter blue color. I'll just show you. Oh, I don't have the color picked for babies. I might make it lavender instead because that's my favorite color. I'm just going to do that real quick so I can show you guys what the colors will be. That's good. So that color will be babies. That color will be toddlers. That color will be children. That color will be teenagers. This color will be elders, and this color will be adults. And when university is unlocked, um, the teen color will also be the young adult color. Alright, so that's locked. Degrees are locked. He does not have a business. That's restricted. Uh, applicable, restricted. His hobby is nature. That's locked. Alright, so he's bi. Facial hair. Hair is matic and gray hair. And he has a thing for Lila. So I'm going to go ahead and update it down here for Lila. Because not only is she with Caden, but she's also with freaking Emmett. Jeez, Lila. Alright, let me just extend that then. There we go. And one more thing to do. Mullins Devereaux. 
I'm gonna stretch it out a little bit because I don't like that it's pressed up against the outline. There you go, that's better. All right. Oh, and I gotta set that to two. <laughs> Almost forgot that. Here we go. The spreadsheet is now updated. So yeah. It seems like round one is going pretty interesting so far. In this episode, we got a townie to move in. Emmett Devereaux. He is now a playable. Congrats, Emmett Devereaux. So I'll say real quick too, I don't know if I've mentioned it yet in this series, but right now we cannot get any more townies. We have to unlock the bus terminal first. I believe it's 50k simoleons that the mayor will have to pay. But as soon as we get that bus terminal down, we can have townies whenever. We have plenty of sims to move in as townies. I actually have a, over 100 sims ready. So that's that's one of our goals is to get the bus terminal. It probably won't be until at least after round two because that's when the mayor will start taxing the, um, the other citizens. How I'm going to be doing taxes is the same way that Dee Dee does in her rules. So it's basically the net worth times 10. So honestly, we'll probably be able to get the bus terminal either round two or round three. It'll probably be one of those for sure. So right now we only have five townies. Okay, so that's one goal that I have. But I'm sure at some point in round one, we will at least have one baby. But we can talk more about that stuff later. So we can go ahead and wrap it up and and let dear Joel and dear Emmett sleep. Oh, look, it's raining in Port Taylor. That's so cute. That is it for this episode of Port Taylor. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope you enjoyed. If you haven't already, please be sure to like and subscribe so you know when to join us again for the next episode. Bye.